The lights were shining brightly on Mackey Arena as Purdue welcomed the national spotlight to West Lafayette Saturday evening. With that came ESPN's college game day, along with the hype and excitement surrounding the Boilermaker faithful. Many critics questioned whether or not Purdue could perform on the primetime stage against a physical tough team like Michigan State. But Purdue silenced the pundits with a resounding 86-76 win over the 18th ranked Spartans. This morning was definitely some, um, some, a great memory to keep, you know, had a college game day here, something we've been wishing for the last few years and we've been pumped up all day for this game and uh, it showed we came out ready to play. I mean, like they say, it's going to always be a great memory for us to have, but making this statement, showing to people that we can play with the best teams in the nation and we have other key pieces that can step up at times, I think it sends that message to the rest of the nation that we are contenders and that even though we lost Rob, that we still are, are a great shot for a national championship in the Big Ten race and people are going to have to be worried about the rest of our key players and know that we're going to give everybody our best shot. With the Saturday primetime showcase came a charged up Mackey Arena crowd, which came into play for the visiting team and the home ball club, as Purdue fed off the friendly environment in what some called the loudest game of the season. Uh, and I think it just, you know, pretty much started from this morning and it kind of just carried over, uh, you know, to the game. But, uh, you know, Mackey, you know, he got really loud tonight. Uh, he got, you know, hard to hear plays. And I know it had to be pretty frustrating for, uh, you know, the opposing team. The victory tonight now sets the stage for an expected top 10 battle in Columbus on Tuesday, as the Boilermakers will travel to Value City Arena to battle number one Ohio State. The winner in that one will take over the Big Ten Conference lead. It's a tall task ahead of Purdue, as Jared Sollinger and the Buckeyes await in Columbus. Reporting here from Mackey Arena for The Exponent, I'm Robbie Donahoe.